said to the disciples, Behold your mother. And when Jesus had received the vinegar, he said, It is finished. And then, crying with a loud voice, he said, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. And he bowed his head and handed over his spirit. Christ for us became obedient unto death, even death on a cross. Let us pray. O oh God, who for our redemption gave your only begotten Son to the death of the cross, and by his glorious resurrection delivered us from the power of our enemy, grant us so to die daily to sin, that we may evermore live with him in the joy of his resurrection, who lives and reigns now and forever. Amen. Holy God, holy heaven mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The thirteenth station, the body of Jesus is placed in the arms of his mother. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. All you who pass by, behold, and see if there is any sorrow like my sorrow. My eyes are spent with weeping. My soul is in tumult. My heart is poured out in grief because of the downfall of my people. Do not call me Naomi, which means pleasant. Call me Mara, which means bitter. For the Almighty has dealt very bitterly with me. Her tears run down her cheeks. And she has none to comfort her. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, by your death you took away the sting of death. Grant to us, your servants, so to follow in faith where you have led the way, that we may at length fall asleep peacefully in you and wake up in your likeness. For your tender mercy's sake. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, Fourteen 
police station, Jesus is laid in the tomb. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When it was evening, there came a rich man from Arimathea named Joseph, who also was a disciple of Jesus. He went to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus. Then Pilate ordered it to be given to him. And Joseph took the body and wrapped it in a clean linen shroud and laid it in his own new tomb, which he had hewed in the rock. And he rolled a great stone to the door of the tomb. You will not abandon me to the grave. Nor let your Holy One see corruption. Let us pray. O oh God, your blessed Son was laid in a tomb in a garden and rested on the Sabbath day. Grant that we who have been buried with him in the waters of baptism may find our perfect rest in his eternal and glorious kingdom where he lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Amen. 